get the car packed and get ready to go. Nice long vacation weekend coming up. Well needed vacation weekend coming up. So let's get ready. Get on the road. All right, time to get things loaded up and get ready to go. But we have to be careful with it because of that right there. Neighbor's dogs are out and they do not like our dog. But we gotta get things loaded up and get him in the car too before we go. So, wish us luck. Well, I'd say we're, I'd say we're about 95% ready to go. It's amazing, such a short trip takes so much stuff. Hey, hey, you ready to go? Up. He's all ready to go, but you don't realize he's just going over to my mom's house. He ain't going with us. Can't have dogs at the park, can we? She wants to read to me. Yeah, it's like a movie in your head. It's a car While ride. we're driving. We could get something on disc. Do you have a CD? Anyway, what? We could do Audible. Audible? Is that how you say it? Audible? Audible? Wow, this is dark. Right. Hey, look, there we are. There we are. All right, let's get on the road. Okay, I can either read to you or we can get Audible. I'll just enjoy the sights and watch the road. Yeah, but you'll listen a little. Half. See, he still thinks that he's going. No. Quick stop at my mom's to drop off Bauer. Where's Oreo? He knows oh. where we're at. She's right he there. He thinks we're going with us. Our other dogs out there on the yard. So, ready, buddy? Hey. No, he's gonna be so Bauer. sad. He's gonna be so sad when we leave. He like gets all mopey and nobody treats him like we do. He sees Mama standing at the door. Well, well, yeah. Last time we dropped him off here, he almost lost a leg. No, just kidding. <laughs> okay, ready, buddy? Hey. Hey, come on. Come on. Is his bag back here in the trunk? Yeah. It might fall out when you open it, so be careful. Ready? Let's go. Where's Oreo? Nope. Did you get the clicker? All right. Come on. What? Hey, let's go. Oreo. Hey, Oreo. Go, buddy. Run. Say hi. There's Oreo. Come here. Bauer. Is there a dog poop there in the yard? Yeah, I see it. Apparently Bauer thinks he's going with us. We darted out of the house and he followed us, so. Sorry buddy, you're not going. Already huffing and puffing out chasing Oreo. All right, one more stop and actually two stops. We gotta get gas. I gotta get a new bank card because mine apparently doesn't want to work anymore, so. Two more stops and we're on the road. That's really sad. No, it's not sad. Not the two stops, the dog. He's sitting right there looking all sad. Okay, well, two more weeks we could do it again. <laughs> it's so weird to walk into a bank and everybody's wearing masks covering up their faces. Oh yeah. But it's just weird to see that because it's the last place you'd expect to see people hiding their faces. <laughs> well, you're not even allowed to wear hats usually. Yeah, you can't wear, wear hats, hoodies, right? sunglasses, but now you can wear masks and like, <laughs> Who knows? Last stop. Then we just gotta get some ice and snacks and stuff. And then we will be on the road. We are 100% ready. And it's a good thing that we had to stop and get gas because somebody forgot the National Parks Pass. We so we would, we would have got all the way up there and not had the pass to get in the parks. All right, let's get on the road. Okay, I'm ready. Vacation time. Yes. Yes. Made a quick stop at our son's house since it's on the way. I would say hi. He's having issues changing oils in the car. No transmission fluid. Yeah, there's no transmission fluid in it and it started acting up, so he thinks the oil change may have caused an issue. <laughs> Anyways, back on the road. Let's get to Wyoming. Got a stretch, tired. Oh, gotta get focus. For the GMC? Alright, oh, 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 oh. we're gonna run across the road here. Oh, the seat's turning. <laughs> Get across the street. Alright, we are stopping in Bear Lake at Laveau's drive in 
for their raspberry shakes and some fries. Well, we'll probably I end like up, the probably apple end up getting one. the apple turnover shake. Yeah. She's spoiling me by scratching my back. <laughs> well, we decided that since we were coming through here, might as well stop and get one of their famous shakes. Take a little break. We're not, yeah, they're supposed to be like famous for their raspberry shakes, but apple cobbler's pretty good too. I think it's better. Yeah. Raspberry ones are like full of seeds. This is like apple pie. When you say apple pie with ice cream on it. Yeah. That's exactly what it's like. Wait, you gotta get it? Yeah. <laughs> it might be hot. Oh man, that's the best part. I was gonna steal it. Alright, you can have this one. Well, I, I think you got more. You're sliding out now. Oh, see, I got two. <laughs> time to get back on the road. Alright, time to get back across the road. And head north. Is it clear? All right, we don't even have to run. Look at that. We can cross the road illegally without last traffic. Time. You, no, you wouldn't have we need to come up here more often. We need a place up here. Let's get a place up here. That would be nice. Okay, hey, YouTubers. <laughs> yeah, YouTubers. She wants you to <laughs> make my channel explode so we can start making money off. Get us a house up here at Bear Lake. And then we'll vlog our trips from Bear Lake, too. Okay, we made it to our first stop. I guess first night, relax, you know, we're staying in these little cabins. This is ours. You can go and check it out. It's Wolf Acres. This is the Wolf Den Log Cabins and RV Park. This is our room for the night tonight. Kind of cute. It's actually kind of cute. Like it's like cabin. a little log cabin. It's kind of nice. We were just going to head up Friday and Saturday into Yellowstone and stay, but we decided to take off Thursday, get a place for Thursday night. We're going to head up into Jackson, Jackson Hole, Jackson, Wyoming, whatever you want to call it. So, you ready? I'm ready. All right. Well, we made it to Jackson, but holy shit, that place was packed. So we're just going to take off for the rest of the evening and head on into Teton National Park and look for some wildlife and animals and stuff like that. So we just got to fill up the gas so we can make it in there and back to our hotel tonight. So we parked on the side of the road. There's a lot of activity down here by the river. We're not sure what exactly is going on, but we got park rangers down here too. This is right by the Jackson Lake Dam or something. Oh, yeah. Yeah, right there behind me. But we're going to walk down here to the river and see if we see anything. Well, we struck out. It was Grizzly Bear 399 or 339. You can Google that and you see photos of her. But she was supposed to be out in those bushes somewhere coming that way, but she never came out. So we're packing up and heading to find some moose. Hopefully find some moose. We did see a huge beaver. Saw a beaver. Maybe two, but no bears. Nothing else yet. Alright, so that's a wrap on day one here. We went into Teton. Hung out for about an hour just off the Jackson Dam and tried to see the grizzly bear and her cubs. It's grizzly bear 399. Yeah. So if you want to search it, go on Google, search Teton grizzly bear 399, and you'll see what I'm talking about. But went back down through, did a bunch of photography. Unfortunately, the images I took today with my 200 to 600 looks like shit. So i am got some work to do on that, but everything that I did with the wide angle lens turned out good. But Tomorrow's a new day. We're going to head up early in the morning, like 4 in the morning. 
to back into Teton and go through some other places into Yellowstone and tomorrow night we will be in West Yellowstone and spend Saturday in the park also. Hopefully I can get things figured out by then but we'll see how things turn out. See you tomorrow.